a new and notably stern warning from the Kensington Palace where it comes to young Prince George and the paparazzi. As Jonathan Vigliotti reports from London, the British royal family is accusing photographers of harassment and really crossing the line. The royal family hoped palace authorized pictures like these would satisfy the world's appetite for the photogenic Prince George, but they didn't. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge are fed up with what they call dangerous surveillance tactics being used by the notoriously aggressive paparazzi. In a strongly worded three-page letter, Kensington Palace warns a line has been crossed and that further escalation in tactics would represent a very real security risk. The palace says photographers have gone so far as to monitor the movements of Prince George and his nanny around London parks, used other children to lure the young prince into view, even hiding in sand dunes on a rural beach to take photos of him playing with his grandmother. Kensington Palace officials say one of the more disturbing cases happened just last week outside a park. A photographer was caught hiding in his car, snapping photos of two-year-old Prince George from a hole in his trunk. Camping out in a car and stalking a kid is pretty brutal. Security is a very huge issue here. Palace correspondent Roya Nika says it's a highly sensitive subject for Prince William. All of William's decisions and his judgment are very much clouded by what happened to Princess Diana, who he still feels was hounded, whatever anyone else thinks, was hounded to her death by the paparazzi. The palace threatens legal action if Prince George or his baby sister, Princess Charlotte, are put at risk. Jonathan Vigliotti, CBS News. London. The Royals express gratitude to news organizations that continue to refuse to publish unauthorized photos and say they are sure parents around the world understand their concerns. Understood.